Apple is about to do the impossible move. What's up guys, we are back again with the iPhone 12 news. We've got a lot of good news here that will make Apple fans and the competition really, really exciting. But first, let's talk about the huge, bold move. Ming-Chi Ko, one of the most trusted Apple leaksters of all times, have come out saying that this year, Apple could go bold once again. Just like they killed the headphone jack and introduced the notch and changed the landscape of smartphone forever, it's time to do that again and this time is the poor charging brick. According to Kuo, Apple will not offer you the charger out of the box and also no ear pods. The reason behind this insane decision is because Apple wants to go truly wireless next year with the iPhone 13 and seems like they are preparing their customers right now this year. It's been further mentioned that Apple will offer a brand new 20 watt fast charger with the iPhone 12 series but you have to buy it separately, it's not gonna come out of the box. This is pretty shocking because we actually expected this to happen next year. The iPhone 12 series is still rocking the lightning board so I don't really understand this early decision but like I said they might be doing this to prepare you guys for the future. It's unclear what the price of this charger will be. If you look at Apple's website, the 18 watt USB charger charger costs $29 so yeah definitely the 20 watt charger won't be cheap it's gonna cost more than $30 for sure of course there will be cheaper options out there from third party manufacturers but still it's a very Apple move indeed just imagine buying a phone and unboxing and then not having the charger out of the box are you kidding me I'm pretty sure it's happening for the first time it's definitely gonna be a very interesting unboxing experience again they want to go fully wireless in the future and this is why they're probably doing this. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Also in the news, the iPhone 12 is expected to cost cheaper for real. Rumor has surfaced earlier that Apple has a fifth iPhone 12 model in the making that will offer 5G connectivity and cost $549 as its starting price. Now, more information suggests that this $549 iPhone might come with an LCD display, which again explains the $549 cheap price. As we have already seen the success of the iPhone 11, it's the best-selling phone in 2020. Majority of people actually don't care about this, or at least the Apple-interested customers. As long as this phone offers the core flagship features of a $1,000 iPhone 12 Pro model, like the same processor, which is the Apple A14 chip, and the same camera, at least two cameras, the wide and ultra wide, I believe most people would be fine with this. Of course, if you want OLED and 5G, the iPhone 12 series will start at $649, which is still shockingly cheap from Apple's own stand. According to his sources, the iPhone 12 and 12 Pro Max will have 120 Hz OLED displays. 120 Hz is the absolute standard that we have with all the expensive phones this year, which is why I think Apple has to pull this off. As we know, the iPhone 11 Pro Max is the king of battery right now. It's got a 60Hz display, but since the iPhone 12 Pro series are getting bigger, especially the Pro Max, which is now coming at 6.7 inches, the battery is definitely getting bigger. And most importantly, we're gonna see world's first 5 nanometer Apple A14 chip, which is going to be a lot more efficient compared to the Apple A13. So I definitely think that the 120Hz on the iPhone combined with the 5 nanometer chip and iOS 14 Apple can easily pull this off smoothly if all goes well. So that's all the news that we have on the iPhone 12. I have to say, a bombshell news regarding the charger and the earpods not coming out of the box. Let me know what you think about this. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.